Hello, good evening, and welcome to my monthly unboxing for my first fiction, Not to Miss Box. And this is the month of May Box. Alrighty. Let's start with the card that tells you about the featured book and it's Meet Cutie. Failing flowers always calm, rational, and controlled until she ended up spoiled all over Daxton, used the former actor she totally crushed on as a teenager. Then she did the unthinkable. She became a mortifying a fangirl in five seconds, which may or may not have included. <laughs> Professing her and dying love. Oh my goodness, poor, poor, poor Kaylin. Alrighty, that's the featured book, Ellen from Ellen Hunting, Meet Cute. And it's a, why, it sounds like a, maybe, a YA romance. Mm, didn't say how old or how young they were. But, alrighty, this is the Fresh Fiction free ebook, A Stranger in Alcott Manor, from Alyssa Richards. Richards. She is a USA Today top-selling author. Alrighty. Uh, Peyton Alcott thought she put the past behind her. Years after being stood up on her wedding day, <laughs> wedding day, she's finally found a dependable new love and a sense of purpose with her high-powered big city lifestyle. So when she returns to her family, opened the newly renovated Alcott Manor, she never expected to awaken all feelings she thought were long dead. That's A Stranger in Alcott Manor by Alyssa Richards. A free, another free ebook is Fuck. It's F-O-K. And it's by Sa Tara Sue Me. They are the Wall Street Royals. Men at the top of their game about to be mastered by the one thing they never counted on. Love. Okay. When Lance Braxton fills in for his six grandmother at auditions for the Juilliard scholarship named after his late mother, the last thing he expects is Celeste Walsh. The moment he sees her, he has to have her. Wants to wants to control her and needs to master her. That's F O K by Tara Sue Me. Right? That's an ebook and it's a visit getmybook.com. It's a long time to get this book, to pick up that book. This month's advanced reader copy is from Jana McGregor, Rogue Most Wanted. Um, it's the next sweeping emotional and witty romance in the Caversham. Harris series from beloved author Jenna McGregor. Jenna McGregor wanted an engagement of convenience, found a noble suitor. Hmm. That's the book from the Cavern Sham Harris. I was just reading the back of the book, forgive me. Alrighty, my mystery book this month, mystery, this is from the Memphis Cold, this is a Memphis Cold Case novel, novel by Patricia Bradley, Justice Delivered. Alrighty, Carly Simit came by her trust issues, honestly. She's been at the mercy of merciless men. Ignored by law enforcement officers who should have helped her and seemingly rejected by her family. She can't even trust herself to do the right thing. Though she is working hard and building a new life, the past continues to haunt her when she discovers that the man she couldn't bring herself to report to the police is still out there, luring vulnerable girls under the guise of being a model agent, modeling agent. When her own niece is kidnapped, Carly must overcome her fears and come forward the information she has. But if that proves to be too little too late, she'll have to go after the perpetrators herself. 
That's Justice Delivered by Patricia Bradley. Alrighty. I wonder if she's gonna find it's a romance with this month, right? I hope she finds romance. Eh? While she's delivering some justice. This is nothing but trouble from Amy Andrews. From I think the USA Today's best selling author also. There's no crying in football. For five years, Celia Morgan's existence has revolved around um, her NFL quarterback boss, he's an ex quarterback, and her, tell you what she said, his father has fallen ill, but she was she had decided to leave his employer, but his, um, his dad fell ill and she really likes his dad, so she went back to stay with and look after his dad. But she's noticing that his jeans look really good and his ass. So let's see how, how soon they can get into the love spirit. And final book out of this month's box is The Refuge. The Refugee. The Refugee. The Refugee. By Anne H. Gabbard. The Refugee. With the threat of a cholera epidemic at their ears. Yeah, this is a um a period piece. And it's Darcy and Walter Goodwin joined the Shakers, whose village seemed immune to the disease. It's meant to be temporary, but when Walter is killed in a riverboat accident, destitute Darcy has little choice but to stay with the Shakers. To complicate matters, she is expecting a baby conceived before she and her husband came to the Shaker village. Marital relationships are considered sinful <laughs> in this celibate community, putting Darcy in a unique and lonely position. Can the arrival of widower Flynn Keller and his headstrong daughter offer Darcy the hope of happiness? All right. And that's the refugee from and H. Debat. All right, those are all the books that came this month in my fresh fiction, not to miss box. I put the link down the bottom. Say so if you want to check out this box, you can do so. All right, I um I do unboxing rather regular as soon as I get them, so you can hit the notification bell to be notified when I have done another set of unboxing so be well be blessed and thank you for watching my video and have a great night